What is offshore? Offshore, in the world of business, refers to where the rules and regulations of a person's or company's home country do not apply. In other words, in another country whose laws regarding business practices, wages and taxation are different. If you live in one country and do business in another, you are participating in offshore transactions. Put simply, the term offshore refers to anything or any type of business activity that is outside the jurisdiction of a country. As far as business and financial situations are concerned, we use the term when talking about foreign investments, deposits, banks or companies. Whenever we say offshore in these contexts, it means abroad. Some offshore activities are legal, while others are not. Money launderers and tax evaders, for example, have offshore bank accounts and shell companies and tax havens. The verb to offshore also means to locate a business or part of it abroad. The company may relocate its accounting, customer service, manufacturing or other service in another country. This may occur because costs such as labour, fuel or raw materials are cheaper there. The Cambridge Dictionary has the following definitions of offshore. Away from or at a distance from the coast of companies and banks based in a different country with different tax rules that cost less money. As a verb, to base a business or part of a business in a different country, usually because it's cheaper. The most popular offshore financial centres have relatively low taxation rates compared to other countries. They also offer clients total secrecy regarding their accounts, financial transactions and business activities. Bermuda, an offshore financial centre or OFC, is one of the world's leaders in aircraft registration, offshore funds and captive insurance. The Bahamas was once a major OFC. However, it has lost ground since 1973 when it became independent. The British Virgin Islands probably have more offshore companies than any other OFC. The Cayman Islands has a very strong presence in the United States securitization market. It is a major asset manager of offshore funds. Since the turn of the century, Dominica has become an important offshore financial center for banks. Since the 1990s, Dublin, Ireland's capital city, has attracted a huge number of multinational pharma, IT and communication companies. Corporate tax in Ireland is the lowest among the advanced economies. There are offshore financial centers in Europe, Asia and the Americas. Lawmakers in the United States, Japan and Europe want to push for a worldwide minimum corporate tax rate to stop individuals and companies evading so much taxation.